day, the energy is apparent. And ABC 10 News reporter Sophia Hernandez has been with me here at Del Mar all day long. She's been talking to the fans, both from the Turf Club down into the stands where everyone's having a good time, enjoying it however they are. It's always an experience, Sophia. Yeah, Kimberly, it really is an energy unlike any other. We've got some fabulous hats, like the one that I'm sporting right now. Tony was so gracious to let me borrow her hat. She handmade this. Take a look. There's got some bedazzling on the bottom. We've got a bird's nest right on top. Pretty, pretty fabulous. We also have a lot of excited fans, some passionate bettors, and of course, I mean, what more could you want, right? Right here at the Del Mar Racetrack, there's a tradition unlike any other and races unlike any other. It's an affair that requires no introduction. So exciting! Where the biggest hats garner the most attention. It's just amazing, just the, the variety and the ideas, and some sometimes the simplest ones look the best, and then other times, you know, you've got these big, huge cake hats. I don't know if you saw that. The Del Mar races have multiple competitions, one for the best hat, but the most important is on the horses. <laughs> I'm feeling good in this ticket. Ray Padilla is what you'd call a betting pro. The day before, I go, bet, go get my racing form, and then I looked at the, all the information that racing form gives you, and then I just go from there. He does extensive research, studies the jockeys and horses, and goes big on his bets. You gotta throw some little bit of long shots in there, because, you know, the bigger the long shot of the horse, the more, the bigger the payout. It's what everyone is doing, placing their cash, waiting, for a victory. Get him, man! Yeah! I love it! Hey, hey, hey! If you were wondering the secret. I think it's go with your gut feeling if you like that horse. You know, first time they always say, uh, if you like that horse, go ahead and bet him. Other than that, it's a day to just enjoy the sunshine, the company you keep, and of course, the races. Now, race seven is about to get started. Ray told me that he bet on all of the races. So we're going to have to check back in with him to see just how many he's won. Uh, but a lot of excitement out here. We showed you earlier just how riled up these fans get when the race gets started, when they cross that finish line. So just a lot of excitement, a lot of hoopla out here on the racetrack. Kimberly. All